ओके हेलो गुड आफ्टरनून एवरी वन टूडे आई विल बी स्पीकिंग अबाउट इम्पावरिंग आई वी डी मैनुफैक्चरस एंड क्लिनिकल साइंटिस्ट वाई एफ एपॉन्स इनोवेटिव ओपन क्लियर एनालाइजर्स सो द थीम इज़ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड टाइमली एज फैपॉन यू कैन सी दैट द कंपनी हैज़ इवॉल्व अ लॉट ड्यूरिंग द लास्ट ट्वेंटी टू ईयर्स सो वी ट्रांजिशन लाइक फ्राम अ की raw material supplier into the reagent provider and then into the one step solution provider where now we are providing like the raw materials reagents uh, customization services as well as all the ivd solutions that the customers require like for a specific uh, assay format from the last two years like we have uh, seen like a lot of potential like for the ecosystem corporations so many of the clinical scientists key opinion leaders as well as the startup into the niche areas they want to develop like the technologies and that is what like we are doing so fapon is enabling like the democratization of the technologies so we provide you the platform we provide you the ingredients of the raw materials and the reagents as well as the customization services and then we help you in the transition like to the novel and the niche products so the next phase of our transition is based like on innovation as well as continuous exploration like into new areas so we will keep on building like on that particular expertise now what is the need like for the open clear analyzers so if you go to the clinical diagnostics most of the analyzers you will see is the closed systems that means only the large companies they can provide the analyzers uh and then they have like a specific menu but if you have like a small company medium company that want to transition like into the next phase then it becomes tricky so you need the solutions like from the provider so fapon is acting as one of the enabling partners to the ivd manufacturers to enable that transition like from manual to the automated and high specialty diagnostics uh now if you see like the first point we already know like from the last decade there is a continuously declining market of manual assays and the transition is going to the automated assays because you have less analyzed analyst time so it reduces lot in terms of the management and the cost and many of the small and the medium companies they are transitioning from manual to the automated assays then the available solutions in the market are all closed so that means the small and the medium players they don't have access to the analyzers that could enable them to transition to the automated assays uh but many of these new biomarkers as well as the assays these are not developed like in the big companies all the time so these are like the specific key opinion leaders as well as the startups that are enabling like most of these new assays and bringing them to life but they have a limitation they can only do it in the manual format then it goes again like to the big ivd player and then it gets transition like to the automated immuno assays but if the transition happens very much at the budding phase then you have like much less effort on the end of the ivd manufacturers so the time to the market is reduced a lot uh when you are discovering like new biomarkers as well as developing like the new diagnostics you need all these platforms and the tools so here we are acting as a tool provider we are providing you the open analyzer which you can use like with our raw material our reagents or if you have developed like your niche raw material and the reagents you can use them or you can use them like from any of the third party that you are collaborating with so you have the complete freedom to operate to develop your diagnostics uh your lab developed test as well as like your companion or the complementary diagnostics or other monitoring tools that you want to develop for any specific reasons uh now as we know like the regulations have changed in the europe so you are transitioning from the ce ivdd to the ivdr and similarly the transition is going on from the manual to the automated assays uh so during this transition like the small and the medium companies they can sustain if they have like the open analyzers 
And lastly, as we, I mentioned, we are democratizing the uh, development of the IVD diagnostics. So there, many of the small and the medium players or the key opinion leaders, uh, they are working in the ecosystem. So you have all these ecosystem and the innovation centers or clusters like you have seen like in Germany, in Switzerland, throughout Europe. Uh, so if you have all these tools with you, this can help you in the development of the diagnostics really quickly. So. So, next is I'm going to speak about our some of the open clear analyzers, how the company transitioned. So we know like the market need is there like for the small players, which requires like uh, you can say the low throughput. So if you are going like to the remote settings to the decentralized labs. Uh, or the physician office labs, then you require like the low throughput. So we have Shine I 1000 series. We can do up to 120 tests per hour, and you can implement like 10 different assays with 30 samples. So this is like the smallest footprint in the entire industry. So you can use this like for the small throughput settings. For the medium throughput, you can go like for the Shine I 2000 series. It can go up to 200 tests. You have like around 60 samples and 25 different assay cartridge that you can put. Then we have like the Shine Eye 8000 or the 9000, where you can go like up to 900 tests if it is a single module. But you can combine four of these modules. So the throughput can be 3000 and the 600 tests per hour, depending on the assay protocol that you require and you can go 60 different assays. So this is the largest throughput I'll say that the entire CLIA industry would have seen. But the market is okay, you have central lab, uh, ICU or the emergency rooms, you have decentralized labs, you have physician office labs or the remote settings. So based on your specific need, you can target the particular uh, analyzer that you require but we are using like the same cartridge in all the different analyzers which means like if you are developing a assay you can immediately develop the assay for all the analyzers you won't have to develop it separately because if you are going like for the IVDR approval or FTA approval uh, your effort declines or it reduces a lot if you develop the assay on all the analyzers in one go then you have like the IFU which is set for the customer that they can operate on all the analyzers. So this was our motivation to go like for all the different throughputs to decrease the effort at the end of the IVD manufacturers. So what are all the characteristic features? Uh, so we have like a open analyzer for the IVD manufacturers. So they can do whatever they want to do with the analyzer. Uh, then the cost is highly affordable. So it is many folds uh, decreased price with respect to the other players. The analyzers, all of the analyzers, they are already IVDR approved. And we are going like for the FDA approval also. So you already have like an open analyzer that you can use for the development directly for your IVDR approved assays or for the FDA. And all the assays that you want to perform. So our analyzers are random access. So there is essentially negligible carryover from one assay to another. And you can opt the analyzer in all the different CLIA formats. We recommend like the flash chemiluminescence based on the acridinium ester. But you can also go for the ABEI, uh, which is another flash chemiluminescence, HRP or the alkaline phosphatase, which is the traditional glow chemiluminescence. You don't require like a separate PC because everything comes like into the interface device that is already there on top of the analyzer. Uh, and you don't require any sample cups which is stacked on like what is there in another. So there is a single cup. So you can put them randomly like into the SA cup compartment. Uh, then the way we do the mixing uh, in the analyzer that is also patented. So it is non-contact. 
uh, and the washing that you do is like the three phase uh, magnetic washing that reduces your background signal a lot. So there are a lot more patents that goes like into the brain of the analyzer that gives you much enhanced features in terms of the uh, assay development and it improves like your sensitivity and the entire performance of your analyzer. Uh, then the way we do the washing of the needle is also unique. In most of the previous analyzers, how you do the washing is by dipping the needle inside a reservoir of the water. But we are cleaning the uh, dispensing needle by a water jet from the inside and two directions the water jet from the outside. Then the type of the clear label which we are using like in terms of the flash, we are using the hydrophilic acridine master which gives you much higher quantum yield uh, and this improves like the performance of your SS. Then we are using the same cartridge for all the analyzers uh, and we are using like the particular grade of the stainless steel uh, that is resistant to many of the chemicals and the other treatments. So there is no carryover, uh, no contamination like of the analyzer and the communication between the analyzer and your LIH or the L HIS is very straightforward. So this is a standard protocol. Then FAPON is acting as a one-step solution provider. Uh, we provide the raw materials, we provide the reagents, we provide the customization services, and we are a high throughput manufacturing industry. So we are come like in one of the top five providers in the entire IVD industry, we are, where we are providing this solution to thousands of IVD manufacturers. So we have a broad experience in this particular field. And we are giving you access to all the expertise that we have in terms of the customization. We have different business cooperation models to enable the smooth transition and development uh, of the particular assets. So we reduce your time to the market manifold. And one unique feature that we provide is the biotin interference free chemistry for the development of the IVD assets. So after the FDA safety alert, so most of the, more than 90% of our CLIA menu, we don't have any interference because we don't employ streptavidine coated beads, which can interfere with your biotin in the patient sample which is available over the counter these days, like for the entire population. So this is like the front side of the smallest footprint analyzer. So we have like a display which contains, which is the computer. So you don't require the external laptop of the computer. The substrates like for your chemiluminescence is on the side. So then you have like a, a assay cartridge or the reagent and it can hold up to 30 different samples inside. Uh, on the side, like you have a barcode scanner and behind like you have a waste reservoir and the waste. So this is a small video. So we have the different flash or the glow chemiluminescence. So these are the substrates. This is the communication, the display device. These are the assay cartridge. So depending on your assay, the performance and the throughput is accordingly. So this is the dispensing needle. So this was the washing. the assay cup and the mixing. Then all the multifarious assay menus, raw materials we are providing to the IVD industry.
So the second is the same design, but it is very high throughput. You can do 25 different assays in one go. Uh, then most of the other things are the same, but it can hold the samples like in six different racks. So you have like around 60 sample positions. So the throughput is around 200 tests per hour. So like you see, we don't have to stack up like any sample tubes. So you can put them randomly, the system will do. So these are the same cartridge that goes in all our analyzers. This is how the washing is done from inside and two different sides from the outside. So this is like the solid waste. So as I mentioned, like these are all the unique features. So non-contact uh, mixing of the samples. Then the, uh, there is a three phase like magnetic washing in which you hold the tube, put the buffer and then the magnetic force separates like the specific reaction components. So then you don't require like any alignment of the assay cups. So they are put randomly and the system will do all by themselves. So this is a single assay cup technology then you can hold like the tube that is very strong dispensing needle and the way we do the washing is very unique and patented there is a photo multiplier tube which has a broad range like for the assay the assay cartridge is the same for all the analyzer then you have a sample rack and the substrates so the same uh, brain we applied like for the largest throughput so this is the largest throughput we launched like in the aacc so the throughput can be up to uh, 900 tests to 3600 tests. It has two different needles and you can do up to 60 different assays. There are multiple patents that goes like inside this particular analyzer, but the manufacturer has a complete freedom and it can do like up to 410 samples in one go. So in one day you can do like up to thousands of samples. So you can do like up to 500, uh, 5000 assay cups. So your assay throughput is increased a lot. Then all the different sample tubes which, is, which are being used in the clinical diagnostics, this, we are, this is already compatible with all our analyzers. So if there is some specific need further, we can also customize like the sample requirements. Then we have a sample volume, reagent volume, the maximum volume that goes like into the development of the assays. So the company shares like all the different customization services, guides you through the protocols, and we also guides you like in the transition from manual to the automated. And this is our biotin interference free CLIA menu. So we are not impacted by the FDA patient safety alerts as most of the reagent providers are. But in future, our panels are more than 200 panels uh, that you will be seeing like from the FAPON. So together, I think like we are providing the complete solution for, to the IVD industry. And if there are any specific needs or any further technical insights you require, so all these systems are already available at our booth. So you are most welcome to visit our booth at Hall 3 at A81. Thank you. Any questions? Thank you. Thank you.